Welcome to the Influencers Project. The aim of these short digital resources is to help you to develop your digital and social media literacy. In this lesson, we are going to explore the topic of secure online engagement, focusing on understanding privacy policies and analyzing how your data is being used on your favorite sites. A privacy policy is a legal document that defines how a website or app manages your data. Privacy policies outline the following. Types of data collected, how data will be collected, how data is stored, security measures used, use of cookies, third party or associate companies, details of data transfers. In 2018, the EU introduced the General Data Protection Regulation, or GDPR for short. One aspect of these guidelines decreed that all companies in the EU must have a privacy policy which is in line with GDPR guidelines. The regulation also requires companies outside of Europe that are using the personal data of people living in the EU to have a privacy policy as well. Privacy policies can be long and filled with a lot of complicated information. GDPR has set strict rules about the management of personal data. There are some key features of a GDPR compliant policy that you should be aware of. Types of personal data collected. A privacy policy should describe clearly the types of data the business is collecting on their website. The types of information collected will depend on the activities you take part in on the site. For example, a website that allows you to set up an account, become part of a mailing list, has a contact us section, etc that will collect contact information. Other forms of data collected are the web browser used or device identifiers, demographics like age, gender, and locality, the site you came from or the site that you go to next, and information that you post online. Data must be collected for a stated purpose. Your data can only be collected for the purpose mentioned in the privacy policy. It cannot be used for any hidden reasons that you are not aware of. It will also be used ethically, meaning that your data will be used confidentially and in a way that is intended to be used when you gave permission. Where data is used for marketing purposes, there must be an opt-out option for users to remove their data from marketing lists. How long your data will be stored? The privacy policy must outline how long your data will be stored for. Personal data identifying you as the user is only meant to be kept for a short period of time. Exceptions to this are allowed when your data is being used for scientific research, but again, this should be stated in the privacy policy. Ability to contact the company. Under the GDPR guidelines, a website or app user should be able to contact the company about their data. The user has the right to change, update, or seek that their data be erased at any time. Clear steps for communication with the business should be included in the privacy policy. Information regarding sharing data with third parties or associate businesses. A privacy policy must tell you if there are third party sites or associate businesses getting access to your personal data. Tools like Google Analytics or AdSense are often linked to websites to get information on users' movements through the internet and tailoring advertisements to their likes and wants. If these tools are being used, the privacy policy must say so. The most common way for companies to gather your information is through the use of cookies. Small text files that keep information and track your usage on a site. Cookies were designed to make your experience on a website better each time you go back, automatically making adjustments to the site based on your choices from the previous visit. EU cookie law requires websites to get consent from the user before recording cookies. There are three types of cookies. One, session cookies. These are temporary cookies and are recorded only for a short time you are using the site. Once you close the browser, the cookies will vanish. Number two, permanent cookies. These cookies do not go away when you close the browser. They are used to help site visitors to remember logins and passwords when they visit a website. They are usually kept for a set time. Three, third-party cookies. These cookies are mainly used for marketing purposes. Third-party cookies store cookies on your device, collecting information with the aim of selecting more relevant advertisements for you. And of course, four, chocolate chip cookies. 
Although that is a completely separate, much more tasty thing. You have now completed this short video, which examined the use of privacy policies, focusing on how your information is used. For more resources that will help you to develop your digital and social media literacy, please visit the Influencers Project website at www.influencersproject.eu.